From the Men of News Studios at Century High School, this is Our Century. Hello and welcome to Our Century. I'm Liz Spryer. And I'm Connor Fitzpatrick. Our top story today is this week our students took home top honors in two of the seven categories at the Kiwanis Team Film Festival. And the winner for drama and action is Carpe Diem, Zachary Buffalo and Carrera of Highland and Century High School. Each of those students won $300, so congratulations to them. Okay. The Navy Band, Northwestern, visited Century High School last week. They brought noise with them. Now let's take a look. surface warfare, but it's fun, see the world, play music, be an MU. Um, I've been playing for about uh, 45 minutes. Uh, no, I, I started playing when I was like, I, I started playing when I was like 13, but I didn't really play, and then 16 is when I started like taking lessons, and then, um, you know, that's kind of when I, yeah. That was really good. Awesome, right? Nice Rock and roll. <laughs> I enjoy it. It's been fun. I've been able to travel across Europe, Africa, Southwest, Pacific Northwest. So. And we would like to thank Miss Bryan's band program for bringing them here. 
All right, coming up after the break, we follow a student to Comic-Con. When you skip school, you get too happy. When you get too happy, you start to do weird things. When you do weird things, people make fun of you. When people make fun of you, you strike back in anger. When you strike back in anger, you end up in the back of a cop car. Don't end up in the back of a cop car. Stay in school. Welcome back. So, Justice Fisher went down to the Salt Palace for Comic-Con. Let's take a look at that. Every year, Comic-Con is held across the country, attracting millions of comic book lovers and sci-fi fanatics. Thank you. Um, so, have you been to Comic-Con? Yes. How many times? Once, and I plan to go to the Comic-Con in April. Where's that at? Down in Salt Lake. So How many times? Once. What was your most interesting experience at said Comic-Con? There was a Deadpool that decided he wanted to cut in line at one point in time, and it was this booth, and he kind of got his ass kicked. Alright. Why? Because people don't want to be crowded in line at Comic-Con. You ever seen a bunch of angry nerds? Yeah. Do you make your own costumes? No, I buy them. The uh, costume is still in progress. It's taken quite a few months to get up the funds. My rabbit costume is just about completed. It consists of face paints, a vest that was custom made during school, and different items bought at thrift stores and online. Just so you know, they're not weirdos. They're normal people. We're going to take another break, and when we come back, we're going to explore Potato Land. Okay, welcome back. Do you know what Idaho is known for? What? Potatoes. Oh. But what a lot of people don't know is that there's actually a lot of beautiful scenery here. So let's take a look at it. So remember, don't judge a state by its potatoes. As always, I'm Connor Fitzpatrick. And I'm Liz Spryer. And this has been our century. Until, Until next, next time. time.